Sugar alcohols also called polyhydric alcohols, polyalcohols, aldetols or glycetols are organic compounds, typically derived from sugars, that comprise a class of polyols. They are white, water-soluble solids that can occur naturally or be produced industrially from sugars. They are used widely in the food industry as thickeners and sweeteners. In commercial foodstuffs, sugar alcohols are commonly used in place of table sugar sucrose, often in combination with high-intensity artificial sweeteners to counter the low sweetness. Xylitol and sorbitol are popular sugar alcohols in commercial foods. <laughs> Production and chemical structure Sugar alcohols have the general formula HOCH2 CHOH NCH2OH. In contrast, sugars have two fewer hydrogen atoms, for example HOCH2 CHOH NCHO or HOCH2 CHOH N1 carbon monoxide CH2OH. The sugar alcohols differ in chain length. Most have five or six carbon chains, because they are derived from pentoses five carbon sugars and hexoses six carbon sugars, respectively. They have one O group attached to each carbon. They are further differentiated by the relative orientation stereochemistry of these O groups. Unlike sugars, which tend to exist as rings, sugar alcohols do not. They can however be dehydrated to give cyclic ethers, e.g. sorbitol can be dehydrated to isosorbide. Sugar alcohols occur naturally and at one time, mannitol was obtained from natural sources. Today, they are often obtained by hydrogenation of sugars, using rainy nickel catalysts. The conversion of glucose and mannose to sorbitol and mannitol is given HOCH2CH O CH O CH O CH O CHO plus H2 HOCH2CH O CH O CH O CH O CHO More than a million tons of sorbitol are produced in this way every year. Xylitol and lactitol are obtained similarly. Erythritol, on the other hand, is obtained by fermentation of glucose and sucrose. Health effects Sugar alcohols do not contribute to tooth decay. Studies have shown xylitol to be a deterrent to tooth decay. Food containing xylitol increased bone density in rat studies. These results have generated interest in the sugar alcohol that would examine if it could be a human treatment for osteoporosis. Consumption of sugar alcohols affects blood sugar levels, although much less than does sucrose comparing by glycemic index. Sugar alcohols, with the exception of erythritol, may also cause bloating and diarrhea when consumed in excessive amounts. <laughs> Common sugar alcohols Both disaccharides and monosaccharides can form sugar alcohols, however, sugar alcohols derived from disaccharides e.g. maltitol and lactitol are not entirely hydrogenated because only one aldehyde group is available for reduction. <laughs> sugar alcohols as food additives As a group, sugar alcohols are not as sweet as sucrose, and they have slightly less food energy than sucrose. Their flavor is like sucrose, and they can be used to mask the unpleasant aftertastes of some high-intensity sweeteners. Sugar alcohols are not metabolized by oral bacteria, and so they do not contribute to tooth decay. They do not brown or caramelize when heated. In addition to their sweetness, some sugar alcohols can produce a noticeable cooling sensation in the mouth when highly concentrated, for instance in sugar-free hard candy or chewing gum. This happens, for example, with the crystalline phase of sorbitol, erythritol, xylitol, mannitol, lactitol and maltitol. The cooling sensation is due to the dissolution of the sugar alcohol being an endothermic heat absorbing reaction, one with a strong heat of solution. Sugar alcohols are usually incompletely absorbed into the bloodstream from the small intestine, which generally results in a smaller change in blood glucose than regular sugar sucrose. This property makes them popular sweeteners among diabetics and people on low carbohydrate diets. However, like many other incompletely digestible substances, overconsumption of sugar alcohols can lead to bloating, diarrhea and flatulence because they are not absorbed in the small intestine. 
Some individuals experience such symptoms even in a single serving quantity. With continued use, most people develop a degree of tolerance to sugar alcohols and no longer experience these symptoms. As an exception, erythritol is actually absorbed in the small intestine and excreted unchanged through urine, so it contributes no calories even though it is rather sweet. The table above presents the relative sweetness and food energy of the most widely used sugar alcohols. Despite the variance in food energy content of sugar alcohols, EU labeling requirements assign a blanket value of 2.4 kcal per gram to all sugar alcohols. See also Sugar substitute